Montgomery County, once a quiet agricultural outpost, continues to evolve in every way with residents who honor the past while building a dynamic and diverse future. And whereas the population of Montgomery County now exceeds more than one million residents who come to our community from all over the world, whereas Montgomery County offers outstanding services and unique experiences for residents year round, including schools that rank among the nation's best, world-class businesses and restaurants, wide-ranging cultural activities and arts venues, recreational opportunities for all interests and ages, and here comes the fun part, for uh, 24 complete hours, to count them, on Friday, April 22nd, from 12.01 a.m. to 12 midnight, Montgomery County Media and its sponsors and partners will document every single corner of Montgomery County across a single day with behind the scenes views of Montgomery County through photographs and videos from hundreds of volunteer contributors who will document every part of life in this unique project. So get your cell phones oiled up uh, because everyone's going to need to contribute to a day in the life of Montgomery County. Whereas the many snapshots of this special day in Montgomery County will forever be preserved and available as a visual record of those who live, work, and play in Montgomery, in America's greatest county. Now, therefore, be it resolved that the County Council of Montgomery County, Maryland, hereby designates Friday, April 22nd, 2016, as a day in the life of Montgomery County. And we encourage residents with cameras and mobile devices con to contribute to this unique project that will document the diverse aspects of Montgomery County, presented on this 12th day of April in the year 2016, which I uh, signed by myself as Council President. This is our fourth year of Day of Life in Montgomery County, again, recognizing really the most dynamic uh, and diverse county in America, the most awesome county in America. So uh, cool. as we talked about, and cool as well, absolutely, absolutely. So on a single day, we will attempt through uh, contributions from the community to capture the depth and, and, and diversity of Montgomery <laughs> County on Friday, April 22nd. And uh, again, these projects have been around for, for decades, uh, but this one is done in real time. Instead of a coffee table book or a calendar, you will see these things happen as they happen live on April 22nd. So your photos and your, and your short videos will come online onto our website as well as our uh, Facebook and Twitter feed. So uh, just again, as Council, Flor uh, Florina, uh, Council President Florina mentioned, it's very easy to participate. All you need to do is pull out your phone and uh, pull out your phone. Shall we all practice? We should practice, absolutely. Everybody? So just take a photo, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, there's what, the millions of people watching at home in addition to here in the room today. So just take a photo. I'm gonna take a little selfie of all of us standing up here. Oh, that's a good idea. There we go. Like we can that. sort of lean in a little bit. All right, there we go. All right. And then all you have to do is, is send it via email to pix, P -I -X, at my, uh, mymcmedia.org, or if you're on Twitter, hashtag D-I-T-L. Hashtag D-I-P-I-X. Thank you. P-I-X at mymcmedia.org. So on April 22nd, the, uh, I'd like to, everybody to be a part of it. And we have many contributors uh, to our project. And just trying to sum up, uh, the financial ones are the most important. They make this project uh, possible. So our sponsors are up here today. Our title sponsor, Montgomery County Employees Federal Credit Union. Uh, President and CEO Jim Norris is here along with his team. They have been with us for four years now since the beginning of this project. So thank you for their support. Uh, Jamie Miller from Giant Food. This is their third year with the project. Again, thank you for, for being here and being part of the project. Uh, Roger Hayden II from uh, Pastor Neck and Fidus back again for another year on this project. And last but certainly not least, the Sanford and Doris Slavin Foundation. Uh, Jeffrey Slavin was on his way. I think he's stuck in traffic, but again, uh, he would be here and part of this for each photo and short video submitted on April April 22nd. The Slavin Foundation is generously donating one dollar to Mana Food Center for each and every video submitted on April 22nd. Oh, so, that isn't an I don't know. <laughs> so thanks to Jeffrey Slavin for his generosity. Uh, Jackie DiCarlo from Mana is is here with us as well. So thank you for being a part of the project. Again, thank you to the County Council. We want to see your photos on April 22nd as well. Thank you very much. Thank you.